Shin Master Hunters. Damn it, I told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. I don't even I don't even know you, bro. Listen to this crap anymore. Two hours. Think it'll clear up soon? What am I, the traffic man? I'm supposed to have been at the pen an hour ago. I'm gonna get written up for this. What's your oh, problem, relax. man? It's not your fault. What the hell, man? What? You know. Cut it out. Jesus, you guys. You gonna make me? Yeah. Hey, Vince. Justin's gonna make me. It's too hot for this shit. Vince, I'm making him hot now. Oh, shit! Come on, Vince. Hey, man. How about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The windows hey, don't... Hey, Justin. Open. See that right, guy man. in the beat-up truck? Ain't right. I'll bet he Shut lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit. I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey, how many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? Damn it, it ain't like that. You telling me there wasn't a star witness waiting around in your white van? I'm shocked. You were convicted, Danny. Gotta admit that much. Oh, come on, Vince. That don't mean I did it. My lawyer's gonna be here. Tell about you what, this. guys. I ain't afraid to say it. I'm really this. missing my girlfriend right now. I'm oh, guessing she's pretty pissed nerve, at you. Man. It's I worse than that, man. She won't talk to me. Mouth. Haven't heard her voice in months. Really messing with me, like for real. Just let it go, man. I want to, but you know. I love her, man. You should call her up when we get there. You gotta face that shit. No, you're right, man. First call I get. Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you, but you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from White Collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? 
hotter than hell up in here. I'm getting dehydrated. Hey, how about some water back here? Shut I up thought you took the stand and cried your eyes out. I'm telling you again. Didn't you lose your yeah, shit and tell them you didn't know what you were doing? Or I'll set you I up. lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand? See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? No, nah, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? Nope. What then? It just ain't right. I gotta admit, I'd say anything to get out of doing more time. You guys are messed up. Says the criminal. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, uh... A pyramid scheme. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. How much did you make off with, anyway? Enough. So, like, a couple hundred K? A little over a hundred. Million. God damn, boy! Ho oh, ho! When we get out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? You know, I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I bet he touched a kid. Two kids? You touch a couple kids, Vince? I helped my little brother. They send you to prison for that now? He was in trouble. I had to help him out. I knew it was something stupid. You regret it, man? If you're saying what I think you are, I got respect for you, man. I don't regret it at all. Sometimes, you gotta do the hard thing. Yeah, I know what you mean. How'd they get you? Tossed the gun up on a roof. And? It was a good throw, and a roofer found it the next day. You gotta be kidding me. Man, you're bad luck, Vince. Bad luck, Vince! <laughs> That's not bad. What do you think, Justin? What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck it? Fuck you! Fuck me? <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker! Oh, oh shit! Man. What the hell is going on, man? Grab tree, yeah. knock it off! Yeah. Hey, get in there, man! Hey, let him go, man! Damn it, Crab Tree! Don't make me come back there He's now. gonna kill him, Vince! Let the guard handle it, guys. Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do not want to get in the middle of that shit, Danny. Vince, we gotta do something. You know this ain't right. I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Where's your empathy, man? Help him, Danny! What's that? Speak up, boy. I can't Fucking hear chain's too short! Crabtree, I'm warning you one He's last time, man. Damn it, you boy. gotta get you in, get in there! In there. Wake that shit up, man! Come on, boy, get back there! Okay, asshole, let him go! Get in between them, goddammit! He's gonna kill that boy! Crabtree? Last what warning! Do you Don't just stand let him there! Let go, goddammit! What the fuck was that? Fuck! Jesus. What happened? What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy! Answer yeah. me back that there! That guy's still alive! Get those cuffs off him, man! What the hell was that? He he made a move on me! I, I, I don't know! He made a move? Or you don't know? Which one? He's still breathing? He's, uh... Fuck! Fuck! You gotta call someone, man! What? I'm calling this in. Don't. Don't call it in yet. Just... Just wait, okay? Just give me a damn minute. He might still be alive. Call a damn ambulance, man. I just need a minute. I need a minute to think. You ain't got a minute. Shut up, you hear me? Just shut your mouth! Okay, okay. Calm down. Take it easy. Everybody needs to calm the fuck down. Situation's bad enough as it is. He's right. Let's all just... Take it down a notch, okay? You really want to pull that trigger again, son? Thanks, man. What the fuck? Did you see that? I saw it. Yeah. Hey, you gotta get us the hell out of here. You're not going anywhere. Fuck that. Get this bus moving. Hey, driver, I said let's go, we're man. We're staying right here. 
We're safe inside the bus. Nothing's gonna. Holy oh, shit! Jesus. Oh my god. Hey. Hey, you need to call someone. You hear me? We need to. Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus. What the hell, man? Back up, back up. Fuck! 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 He can't reach us. You sure about that? That ankle's gonna get him. Shit. What are we doing, guys? Come on! We gotta do something! Find a weapon. What kind of weapon? Where's the guard's gun? Yeah, yeah, the gun. Good thinking, Justin. Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It's underneath him. Oh, fuck me. Get the gun, man! Get up, Vince! Hurry up! Shoot this asshole, Vince! Do it! Oh! Watch it, man! Sorry. Sorry. Man, I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. Man, that guy sure did a number on him. Tore his damn throat out. Shit! Fuck this. What are you doing? Can't do anything until we get out of these damn chains. Maybe he's got the keys on him. Nothing. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? He must have left them up front. Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, don't. Hey, buddy! What the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot fuck in. you, man. We gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. That's not gonna hold. Vince! Fire the fucking gun! Need those keys. Shoot him again, man! Whoa, whoa, watch it! Ain't gonna work! I think he just pissed them off. Yeah, yeah, save the shells. How the hell are we gonna get out There's of here? There's gotta be a way. Can't we just shoot off the chains? No way! Wouldn't cut through. What about the cup? If we shoot one of those off, the chain will slip right out. Are you fucking insane? What do you think is gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's gun? Well, what do you think is gonna happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun. We gotta do this. Back off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Vince, what the fuck? Sorry, man. Fuck you! Do it! Hurry! Justin's just gonna slow you down. Do it again! Come on, let's go! Hey, Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this?
What do you think that does to a kid? I'm trying to protect her from it as much as possible. Things are stable here, for now. I wanted to grow up with this, not what's outside these walls. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Uh-uh. I don't want you messing with those unless we're in danger, okay? I'll take care of those later. Fine. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Eesh, these knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. The diner looked pretty nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. Did you ever find out what happened there? No. Roman said it was like this when he and Stephanie found the place. Could be anything these days, though. Still, better not to think about it. Hey, Becca. Think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh, yeah. Then we can spend all our money at nowhere. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. God, what I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee in the morning. This hasn't worked in a long time. Smells good. Next time we venture out for supplies, I gotta remember to look for light bulbs, too. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. Ooh, starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. I don't miss going on raids for this stuff. Oh, you scared me! He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. It's disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, 
sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Again. Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. <sighs> you just... You can't go jumping out at people. Not anymore. It's not safe. But... What if I had a weapon? I could have thought you were a walker. What are you talking about? I... <sighs> Look, I... I just saw our walkers out back eating a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me you know it was it was so little you don't think about babies anymore but after a while you just kind of accept this is it yeah i guess you kind of forget <laughs> right but then you know there it is you see it and you want to protect it and, and now it's gone that sucks Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell! Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. Come here, everyone! Shit! Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mop them. It's so okay to be here. Jesus. Largum. My God. Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No. They didn't get that close. Who is he? I got no idea. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some. We'll send him on but his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I guess that would be okay. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boy, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he He gonna... can't even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. Are you judging him based on race? Of course not. But come on. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. He made us beat up that guy with a mustache and steal his boat. We did that. I've regretted it ever since. 
That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Fuck you, Roman. Shell, come on. Roman's right. We need to protect ourselves first. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? We have to set him free. We can't. He's not even armed. We can't just kill him. This isn't in self-defense. Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I'm not ready to let that go. Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, Give him have? some food. When, three or four cans. Just as a gesture of good faith. And get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying, but you better understand this. You came this close to death today. And if you ever, ever come near this place again, or tell anybody where we are, you wish you had died today. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. I mean, it was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then I should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? Maybe he found out about the boards? Shit. You think so? If he did, I won't say anything. But you better stay away from there for a while. Okay. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. How come no one's watering these?
Joyce, do you know what's going on? I don't know if I should say anything. Please, what is it? They caught Stephanie stealing and then trying to escape. Oh my god. What are they gonna do? I don't know. What can we do? I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Roman? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel... I don't know... oppressive? We've made it safe. But she was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You want me to take care of it. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. But we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us a hundred percent. Let's talk to her first. See if we can talk some sense into her. No. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. If we give her a second chance, she might not try to leave so quietly. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is.
sorry. Me too. Okay, got one. A snake for a tongue. You're so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? Can I control this snake, or does it have free reign? Free reign. Well... I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Snake tongue. Gross. What? How is it more gross than lobster hands? Well, for one, it's in your mouth. Hey, you asked the question, Haas. Okay. How about... Well, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Well, uh, you gotta admit anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. Uh, what I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. You know, you're not perfect either, Mr. Lobster Hands. Maybe I should spend a minute listing off your flaws. See how you like it. Me? I ain't perfect? That's right. And you're older than dirt. Look, as long as you stay off that stuff... You can have all the flaws you want. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. Yeah, I'm a real poster child. I could see you on a brochure. Oh, like the ones at the dentist? Before and after, with the puffy face and the yellow teeth. Just look at her now. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? I know. God, Leland. Thank you. Bonnie, uh... Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters? Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot. For the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. Well, that ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. Don't I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your, uh, girlfriend, but, uh, we gotta get moving. Does she think we... So, where'd you get the bag, Dee? 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 Did you hear me? Let's keep moving. I feel like I've been in a washing machine all day. I'd kill for a towel right now. Or a blow dryer. <laughs> yes, good lord, deliver us a blow dryer. Hey, Dee, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, Dee, that, that bad. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Damn it, Dee, you gotta give us more than that. Was anyone there? I don't think so. You don't think, or you don't know. Those mean the same thing, Leland. Just tell us, baby. 
You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. We should get moving but now. But you are the on, one who made me dark. stop. Irregardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now we're You're standing gonna draw every damn thing goddamn thing miles around in this you keep goddamn like this. middle of nowhere you did place. That on purpose. You listen to me now. I have had it up I to here with listening to you. To blaspheme. I can't believe you. Oh, forget the both of you. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please. We can sort this out. Oh, Lord, give me strength. We'll straighten this out. We will. Right, Dee? We, we can solve this out. We just need to get somewhere else. Oh, now you agree with me. Bonnie, darling, I'm, I'm sorry we're... Darling? Dee, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours, too. Dee, now's not the time. Whatever issues we got, we'll hash them out later. What are you saying? You know exactly what I'm saying. Well, come on now, Dee. No reason to pick a fight. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on, we gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. You see something? Where the hell? Shit. Where are you? Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here. Bonnie. <gasps> Dee? Oh, God, Dee! I I'm so sorry. Oh, God! Why? You... 
Why? Do, do, do I love you? How bad is it? It was dark. It's so dark. I, I couldn't see you. I, I didn't know it was you. How was I supposed to know it was you? Mm. There, there was no... Mm. I thought I saw you. You, you did this. Oh, God, you killed me. You, you killed me. Anybody see anything? I should it's never have dark out here. trusted you. Just, just a junkie. Leland, <laughs> she, she did this to me. I, I didn't mean to do this, Dee. I swear to God, I didn't mean to. You, you love him. I saw seeing him. Look at you. I, I, no, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. You, bitch. Mary, you wanted him. Didn't thank you. Help the stones. Dee, I would never. I swear this has nothing to do with him. It was an accident. You fucking junkie. Spread out. It can't be far. Dee. Dee, did you find her? Honey, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? Me. God, what happened? Oh, Jesus, oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, Dee. Darling, what happened to you? I had to. I, I thought you would... What do you mean? Bonnie, what was that you just said? It really was an accident, Leyland. It, it really... You did this? You did this to my D? Hey, gotta be closing in. She came out of nowhere. I thought she was one of them. I, I didn't see her until she was right there. I don't... I don't believe this. I don't understand. How did it happen? I'm sorry. I'm... Sorry, Leland. Bonnie. Back this way! Oh, I no, feel sick. Going... Which way? There! I'm sorry to do this to you, darling. I'll leave you here. Call out if you see this him. way. I know it's hard, but I need you, Leland. <laughs> I think I saw something over here. She's gonna die for this thing. I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. you shoot that guy, man? What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do it. It just happened, okay? Where the fuck were you with a warning? Me? You're putting that on me now? I didn't see the guy either. I was too worried those dudes were gonna pull guns on us. Shit! Dude, how'd they catch up to us? Who gives a shit? Just... Hurry up, Betty! Here, man. Shoot! Dude, get him, man! Jesus.
Feel that look on me, man. I'm not being an asshole. I'm being smart. No lights, no, uh, you know, they can't see us. Christ, I can taste blood in my mouth. I don't think it's mine. Crashing into a cow ain't gonna help anything, man. Oh, shit! I should watch out for cows! Cows! Why didn't I think of that? When's the last time you saw a cow, dude? Okay, bad example, but you could still hit something, man. God, I can't believe we're in this shit. Don't barf just yet, okay? Please? This road is really straight. We'll be fine. At least slow down. What? Fuck no! Did you see that one guy's eyes, man? He's fucking gorked. I don't want that guy in my life, Wyatt. Dude, you are covered in that guy's blood. I know, Wyatt. My shirt is soaked. It's like... I just... Why didn't they say anything? The guy's taking his shit over there. That's all they had to say. I'm sure it was an accident. I'm not. I wish I was, but... Ah! Ow. <laughs> Look, Wyatt. All I know is those guys had me all jacked up, like I was on speed or something. I was just on edge, you know? Then I was like watching that guy's brains come out of the back of his head. I'm sorry, man. I. Well, thanks for getting us out anyway. About time. I will punch your eyes. See? It's fine. Road straight as my dick. You think we're in the clear? Not till we get out of this fog. Was that a pun? No. When did you start making puns? I said no, idiot. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's Tom Cruise out of here. Why is it that you never had a girlfriend again? Oh, right. Forgot there was more than one reason. See if there's still any sticky in the glove box. I don't see anything. Dude, it's in there. Look harder. I don't see it. What I do see is that ammo that you lost last week. Oh my god, really? But is there any weed? You know, one time I was going out with this girl, right? Abigail. You remember her? And she told me that she was five, I think. Her dad took her to the bank. Loading the gun is probably more important right this second. Thanks. Okay. Weird, but okay. Shit! <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Did you get a look? I think that was a guy. Wyatt, come on, man, say something. Was that a dude or not? What the... The fucking fog. This night is so fucked, man. I think it... I think he was alive. Ah! Let's see if there's anything around the car. You know, anything that'll, like, tell us one way or the other. That way, we can just book. But I'm not leaving if we hit a human being, man. I'm just... not. Man, don't roll it down broken. I can't see through the cracks. Look, it's fine, see? Dude, what's that on the broken side mirror? It's part of a shirt, I think. Yeah. But plenty of dead guys have shirts on. Keep looking. You think that blood on the windshield is fresh? Or is rotten? that the mirror from the car? Can't tell from here. What's that way out in the road? Does that blood look fresh to you? Yeah, but it's kind of dark. Yeah. Damn. Man, I'm really not seeing anything. Seriously, you think some piece of that guy made it into the glove box? Man, I don't know. Look, Wyatt, 
It was a guy. Are you sure? Yes. How sure? Pretty fucking sure. Don't fuck with Tiny Carlos, sure. Jesus. So what do we do? What do you mean, what do we do? We go out there. Go out there and what? Find the guy and help him. Who the hell are you tonight? If it's a guy. It's a guy. I saw him. Come on, man. This is stupid. We go out there, we check it out, we get moving. <sighs> Fine. I'll go. Give me the gun. Dude, I'm the one who got us into this. I'm the one who hit him. Should be me going. Then why did you ask which one of us should go? Oh, sorry. Next time I get into this exact crazy fucking situation, I'll figure out how I feel before I talk. Okay. Well... Shit, okay. Here, we'll rock, paper, scissors for it. Are you fucking serious? No. Come on. Sitting here is making me nervous. Man, I can't believe I'm doing this shit. Dude, two seconds, it's over. Alright, two out of three, right? Sure. One, two, three, go. Shit. Alright, alright. Okay. Alright. One, two, three, go. Fuck! What are the chances of that? Okay. One, two, three, go. Shit, man. <laughs> Insane. Okay. Again. One, two, three, go. Jesus H, how many times is this gonna happen? One, two, three, go. Ah, paper never wins, dude. Paper is the Germany of hand gestures. All right, dude. This is it. Shit. One, two, three, go. Always with the rock. Too much rock, Wyatt. Now tell me about it. Son of a bitch. All right. I got this. Be careful, dude. Jack, should I take it? No, man. What the fuck is taking so long? Hurry up. It'd be great, backpack, if you could tell me if your owner was alive or not. All right, I guess I'll just keep talking to myself out here because that makes sense. You okay? Fella? You need to answer me, man. If you're a dude, I don't want to shoot you. Please, just say something, mister. Not sure if you're deaf, dead, or just an asshole, man. Oh, shit. Are you okay? Uh, sir? Can you, can you hear me? Looks like he's pretty out of it. Jesus. This is bad. Man, this guy's a cop. Cop, please be okay.
Okay. Uh. Ah. Fuck it. All right, let's get your ass to the car. Shouldn't have maybe taken so many cans. Ah, oh, I miss the days of taking shortcuts. Hey, you getting up? Good. I should probably hurry. Shit, shit, shit. I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. Shit, bro. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't. What's your name? Russell. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? It's mine. I didn't steal it. All right, good. I don't like thieves. Just get in the car. 
You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on. Scoot. Ain't gonna wait forever. Fine. Fuck. See if I give a shit. You take me to Statesboro? I'm trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she likes to party? Just get in, we'll get there. Or somewhere, eventually. Name's Nate, by the way, thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh... Here you go. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? This is the fucking apocalypse. This is like... nothing. No, I'm just good, all right? All right, all right. You want to tell me about where you come from, at least? Must have been with a crew. Any tail back where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. No, uh, tail. Damn. I retract my question. There was a girl who I liked, all right. You're arguing semantics, Russ. Give a pal the deets. <sighs> all right. There were seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They're all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. We found survivors. It was the same every time. He... Let it out, Paco. Just, we gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang, they'd be dead. Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rack? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I'll put it right in here. You're fucking rude, man. Oh, you're Miss Manners, that it? Let's try again. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. The fuck? Come on. Scale it one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was dropped, right? What do you think? Here, get a look. Fuck! Ah, ah, like a nine, right? Get off me! Maybe you got high standards. Oh, if you say five, I'm gonna flip. Fuck! Tell me, Russ. Ten, okay? Ten, you psycho! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Damn it. Load that, bullets in the glove there. Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. I. Oh shit! Go! Russ! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! I'll get fucking shot! No, you won't! I'll cover you! This guy can't hit the broadside of a barn! Just move your ass! Good 
us. What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did. I shouldn't have come with you. Well, it's too fucking late now. You need to relax, Russell. Come on, kid. Look at me. Russell, get your shit together. There is no getting out of this right now, okay? Okay. Now help me out of here. First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Stay down! See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. Alright, yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Shit! Just keep pushing! side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously this time. I'm not fucking around. We won't make it. No way. Yes, we will. We cover each other. Toss the gun back and forth. If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you want to go first, that's fine too. Cover. You go first. Just shoot at the window and keep that fucker's head down till I get where I'm going. Then throw me the gun, and I'll do the same. Ready? Yeah. You ready, Russ? Remember, don't stop shooting. Fire! All right, throw me the gun, and I'll cover you. Good job! Now what? We get over there and we should be good. Go! more work to do. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this asshole. Follow me. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking quiet. We're gonna sneak up on this son of a bitch and take him out. You hear me? Not a fucking beep. Let's go. I see him. Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. I think I saw a guy. No shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Jump out, grab it. Your call. Walt! Oh! Get the fuck out of here, you monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here. Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook. 
First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying, and now she can see your face. We've never been here, sir. Then who shot my wife? Wasn't us. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, just get the fuck out of here. Please, leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? I'm done. That's it, man. I don't know you, and I don't want to. Can't you take a fucking joke? Fuck your jokes. I'm sorry. I'm out. Come on. Can we still be friends? No. We were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Oh, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. Building a good community here, we want to keep it that way. Of course. <laughs> So good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. You got it. Hey! Don't you Vince! Don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because you have to tell the truth all the time doesn't mean everyone else does. If I didn't trust people, I'd be dead. I know that for sure. People can care about you if you let them. Like Leland cared when he let you run off alone? That's enough, Becca. I heard rumors about these places. This guy I was traveling with ditched me trying to find one in his own. He thought... You know what? Let's do this. She looks well fed, right? And clean? We could all use a meal and a hot shower. Hold up. We don't know what kind of people we're dealing with. I don't want to get stuck with some crazy asshole like Russell did. I walked away from that shit, Wyatt. And that dude was crazy from Jump Street. Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group or split up or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Shell, why are we even listening to her? She's obviously lying. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were going to defend it. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. What will it take to convince you? I don't know. Russell, come on. 
Guys, trust me. We need to get to this place. Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? You clearly outnumber me. If you wanted to overpower me, you could. Hell, I'll even go along as your hostage until you feel safe. No one is gonna hurt you. That's not a bad idea, actually. And I'll do it. Because I know when you guys see this place, you'll change your minds. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? Yeah, I'm going. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. We have people of all ages in our colony. Teenagers, whole families. It's a chance to reconnect with people the way you used to. That's not true. I believe her, Becca. Look at her. This is not someone who's been struggling the way we have. It makes sense. Can you promise my sister will be safe? She'll be as safe as she was before all this happened. Shell, this might sound stupid, but... I think I actually want to go. Okay, if it means that much to you. I'm glad you feel that way. We're not going to be out this way again for a long time. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? I give you my word. <laughs> 